today we're going to go ahead and demonstrate to you one of our brand new items. You're looking at a three glass door fridge, commercial fridge. You can use it anywhere from the restaurant, liquor store, anything like that. Now let's go ahead and give you the overall dimensions before we get started on more. For the length, you're looking at 79 inches of the length. For the depth, you're going to be looking at about 28 and a half inches. The overall height for this unit, up until the bottom, you're going to be looking at about 85, about 84 and a half inches high. The unit does have wheels on the bottom and also has legs, so if you, you need the the wheels you can take out the legs or the other way around you can take out the wheels if you just need the legs on this unit also in the front we have a control system over here in the top right corner you have your Dixel control system right here you can set your temperature it also displays the temperature to which the unit is running on and it has a knob switch as well okay so you let's go ahead and open up the doors inside we have our shelves you're gonna have a total of 18 shelves six per each uh, door over here as you can see, you can adjust these shelves to whatever level you want, okay? You can go ahead and do that. Slide. You can slide them uh, down. Also okay. inside, take a look right there. We have our sliding racks right there. Yes, sir. Our sliding racks. Yes. Uh, also inside, you have LED lighting for this unit. Take a look. The LED lights are located on the sides, one for each side, one on the right side, one on the left side. You have your fans inside as well. You have five fans inside for this refrigerator. Okay. And then over here, as you can take a look, we have a copper line. And then we also have a box right here. This is where your compressor is. So this unit, the function is going to be different. Compressor is not located in the refrigerator. Compressor for this unit will be uh, hooked up or put in, top, in your top roof alongside with the copper line. You have to weld it up yourself. So this is uh, just to prevent the refrigerator from getting hot. Usually when the compressor is on the bottom, the unit gets really hot inside the room. So for this refrigerator, compressor is gonna be separate, placed on the top of the roof, alongside with the copper line. Okay, so that's the different function for this refrigerator. Let's go ahead and give you the inside dimensions as well. So you have an idea for this refrigerator. For the depth, you're gonna be looking at about 24 inches of the depth. Left to right, and give me one second here. Okay, go ahead and give you the depth to right measurements. You're looking at about 75 inches left to right. And then overall height of the inside, me overall height of the inside you're gonna be looking at about about 69 inches of the inside so that's gonna be your inside dimensions for this refrigerator the unit is gonna be 110 unit okay so it's a 110 volt unit for this three glass door refrigerator and then on the back I'm gonna go ahead and show you this pipe right here it's just a drain for the water all the water uh, we'll go down through the back of this pipe right here and out through the back Okay, so that's just gonna be a drain for water and then also on the back We have a sticker with more information regarding the fridge for example the electrical you got your amperage You got your Hertz your volts as we explained volts is 110 refrigerant is R134 And then we have a hookup over here on the back as well copper So that's pretty much a little demonstration on this three glass door refrigerator. If you have any other questions or are interested in one of these units, feel free to go on our website, coolerdepotusa.com. All the information will be on our website, including the price for this unit. You can also give us a call and we can help you guys out with any questions you guys might have. Thank you for watching.